Hi there, this is Shauna Brooks with Keller Williams Realty, and today we are going to talk about how a change in interest rates affects you as a buyer. Hey there, welcome back. Today we're going to talk about our local market and um, how and what's going on with interest rates. Um, for the month of December, our overall sales were up 4.2% from November. And as we ended fourth quarter of 2016, fourth quarter ended 10.2% higher than third quarter, which is really interesting because uh, fourth quarter typically is not a strong sales month. Um, third quarter. Second and third quarter are actually our biggest months. So to end fourth quarter with a 10.2% uh, increase over third quarter was very significant. Um, most importantly, what I want to talk about today is interest rates and how they affect you as a buyer. Um, let's say right now interest rates are at about 4%. And um, by the way, just because they say they're at 4%, that doesn't necessarily mean that your specific interest rate would be 4%. Your specific interest rate is gonna depend on your credit score, your income, and your debt ratio. That's just kind of a little side note. But let's just say that your interest rate right now was 4%. And let's say your lender had approved you for a loan amount of 250,000. Awesome. That's great. The reason why you're getting that big fat loan amount is because interest rates are so low. But here's the important thing to watch. If you are, if you are at all watching the market and what interest rates are doing, a half a percent increase in interest rates reduces your buying power by 10%. So here's what that means. If you're approved for 250,000 at an interest rate of 4%, if that interest rate goes up to 4.5% and you lose 10% of your buying power, 10% of 250,000 is $25,000. So if interest rates go up to 4.5%, you are now approved for 225,000. That's very significant and very important for you to grasp as a buyer. So if, you're, if your goal is to buy your dream home, I promise you the time is now. Every time interest rates go up, your buying power goes down. Again, the rule of thumb is if interest rates go up by half a percent, your buying power goes down by 10%. So now's the time to take action and we are here to help any way we can. If there's more that we can do for you, feel free to call, text, or click on the link below. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.